Hey guys, welcome in. Okay. We're uh, cleaning up my Alexander wings. I bought these like three, four years ago for like a hundred dollars. These are going for like five, six hundred bucks for this size, for ten and a half. So I figured, you know what? I'm kind of inclined to clean them up <laughs> and wear them out now because I put them in storage for way too long. Oh God, Chris is here again. If you're always gonna come to troll Chris, why even bother? <laughs> Bruh. So when you guys are gonna go to Wario 39, dude? What's up, Cody? Um, I'm cleaning these up before lunch. I am starving right now, but I kind of want to get this done before I leave the house. Or at least one pair, depending on how long it's going to take to clean them. Yeah, dude, the place is fire. Super nice. Honestly, you just take beach all the way down. <laughs> just get the beach and drive t towards the beach, honestly. You'll be there. I cannot believe I've never cleaned this pair of shoes. Do you think Denver are winning? I don't watch sports, man, sorry. I play basketball, but I don't watch it. <laughs> yeah, and I've seen you drive further, Krista. I've seen that fucking late night 2 a.m. drive and shit. You can definitely get to Rodeo 39. <laughs> um, with these I feel like I think I'm just gonna try to. Um, I was gonna soak them in the water. So, uh, goat. I get all my shoes from goat. Mainly goat. I used to get them from StockX, but with all the recent news and stuff, I I'm staying away. Squeezing the foam here. If you see the foam, you're in the zone. I'm gonna save myself 150 bucks. Cowboy boots? You mean your cowboy boots, Cursor? I don't have cowboy boots. I'm gonna save myself 150 bucks. The guy's kind of iconic, I have to say. What's up, Hyper Man? I'm just scrubbing on the laces a little bit, and I'm gonna soak them in the soak them in the solution. Hey, where's the food? Um, uh, at the at the at the market. I'm cleaning laces right now, so I have my uh, Alexander Wang um, soccer shoes. I freaking love these because of the thick boost. Actually, let me back up, back that ass up a little bit. Okay. Uh, scrub, scrub the laces, try to clean them up a little bit, and then um, soak them in the solution. Kind of making a little mess, but it's okay. I mean. pair of lace in. Graduate from tomorrow, uh, high school from tomorrow, I'm nervous. Oh, for sure, dude. It's all good, man. I graduated in 06. It's all good, dog. Um, I had Jordan bred 11s, but um, not anymore. I do want the Space Jams, though. Just because it's so iconic, and I, and I saw the movie as a kid. You know, it wasn't a favorite movie, but it was definitely a good movie. When you see the foam, you're in the zone. Oh yeah, man, you gotta join my demon hour for that, for sure. Taking off the laces, just cleaning these up, soaking them. I feel like I figured these might be better in the washer, but you know what? Screw it. And they're the stock laces too, so I want to keep them. What's up, Fern? Hey, Ashley. 
I, I cleaned one pair of the laces already, kind of. I'm just gonna scrub them down a little bit and then soak them in the solution while I uh, um, scrub down the, the pairs. Or the pair, whatever. I'm good, how are you? Hey, Ashley, how's it going? Man, this thing is uh, dirty. I took these freaking hiking too, man. I think that's what kind of like made me not want to wear them anymore. I thought, oh my God, spring everywhere. Which is better, Jordan 11s or 5s? I like the 11s more than the 5s. I don't have any 5s. But I think the 11s look a little nicer. But I'm actually not a big fan of pan leather either. So I guess it depends on the collaboration. Nice, Ashley. Good job. And some parts that are dirty. I'm using a uh, Jason Mark, but I'm making a mess. I'm like splashing everywhere. But yeah. Okay. I just saved myself 150 bucks. <laughs> Cause when you see the phone, you're in the zone. I'm gonna add a little more water into this. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> um, I did do my Taco Bell order already. It's like, you gotta score down a little bit. I don't know if this is doing anything, but I'm I, in my mind. I, I think I'm doing something. So, okay, do another couple of squeezes, add in more solution, and I'm gonna let it soak a little longer. Oh, I mean, I'm gonna have it soak throughout the whole time. I'm I'm cleaning the shoes. Okay. No, I don't have a PS5. I have a um, I have a Nintendo Switch. I put on chapstick, people say I have lip gloss. I don't put on chapstick, everyone says I have chap lips. Can't win. Fuck. <laughs> oh yeah, I have, I have too many of them. Okay. Let's go. I got on Amazon. I get everything on Amazon. Hey, Bella. Okay, that's cool. I hope you have a good time. Hope you have a wonderful time over there, Bella. Do you clean the insole? I don't... There's some some thin ass insoles. I might I might get. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get um. The other the. Um, the you know um the Spenco ones. I might get the Spenco ones for her. Joe's about six. I have more shoes coming in, so I won't be able to show them uh, show the shoe collection until I have all my shoes in. So, so yeah. Yeah, brush out the insoles. Okay, for sure. And just let them. Uh, I'm like clean. I'm like cleaning out the the inside. Uh, I haven't eaten anything yet. This is fucking Joe's fur. 
of course. Sub tree. Oh man. Okay, it's good. All the stitching is still good. It's not too bad in there. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. I guess I'm gonna scrub this a little bit. I'm gonna scrub this and then save it. And then I'm gonna get replacement um, insoles for these shoes just to make them even more comfy for me. Hell no, man. These are designer freaking insoles. You kidding me? You're gonna find insoles that says Alexander Wang all across it with the with the design. This is a collector's piece, bruh. The fuck? Save all the insoles. Some insoles are like straight art pieces. They look really nice. Yeah. Hell no, I'm gonna throw these out. I'm gonna replace them, but definitely save these for sure. Just to, just make it a part of the the whole thing. Um, he's a really big designer. I know he's not really well known in like in like kind of like Virgil Abloh, you know what I mean? But he does have a he has his own store in South Coast, and he's had really big collaborations with Adidas. He has really nice shoes too. But yeah, all right. Um, let's start with the the tongue, I guess. Man, I haven't freaking seen this shit in forever, man. It feels nice too. Um, during my, um, I come up on, on TikTok and Instagram and starting to really um, do this job seriously, I told myself I was gonna wear this pair every day. Cause it was like a, a nice designer pair, but I'm just gonna beat them up and then just kind of have like that like, oh shit. To the point where like, I don't care that I'm wearing nice shoes every day because I'm trying to work towards something bigger, you know what I mean? So yeah, these kind of have a big significant meaning. Yeah, you already know, dude. And the thing, it just sucks suede is, is, I feel like it's a lot harder to clean just because it takes in dirt really, really well. But yeah, this suede's really nice. It's a really good suede. Let's do the toe box. I cannot believe I took these hiking, man. Um, not on purpose. Um, there was a hike that wasn't intended. And I was wearing these shoes, man. And I was pretty mad. Oh yeah, yeah. Nike two seventies. Damn, it, Amber, how how hard you want me to scrub? You scrub it like how hard you want. How hard you want me to scrub it, Amber? You tell me how hard. Oh, really? Because I thought you have to use a hard one. What? You're just telling me to scrub it harder. I'm just saying. Like. <laughs> oh, man. I feel like I'd rather have a soft brush than a hard one to damage it, you know what I mean? I'm just using the, um, the thing. I know. How you been, Amber? Well, I mean, I haven't been really been going live too much on, on TikTok.
No, I'm using um, Jason Mark cleaning. No, no, I don't think I need a toothbrush. I'd rather use a soft brush just so I don't damage it. And then I'm just cleaning off as much as I can. You know. He's doing a pretty good job though. Compared to, I think. Okay, I don't know if that's I don't know if that's a big difference or not. <laughs> yeah, and I usually just wear designer shoes. Not designer designer, but there's there's a special thing about them. I don't wear regular shoes. There's got to be something, a nice colorway, a nice theme, a nice uh, collaboration, a nice, um, uh, you know what I mean? That type of shit. I have to make it a little extra personable when it comes to um, my shoes. Because you're a sneaker, you kind of have to, you know what I mean? Yeah, I know. I don't have a hard bristle though, so this is all I got. So I'm just gonna just get whatever cleaning I can from this, and then you know. <laughs> I come out to t yeah. I, I'm sure. I'm sure you do, Tim. I'm sure you do. Man, the fact the fact that these are like a beige gray color, I guess that's kind of good. Where I guess you don't really see the dirt that much. I don't know, man. Shit. And the wear and tear is like nothing. I've worn these so much. Look at that. There's like barely any heel drag. And I and the way I walk, I usually have a lot of heel drag. Just, I don't know. Just promoted Stony House Life. Uh, oh shit! Nice, dude. Congrats. It's good, man. How are you? LV sneakers, bro. I would not want to ever pay for LV. So it's so funny. I don't mind paying. I don't mind dropping a a fucking rack on Travis Scott Olive Jordan ones. But I do not want to pay eight hundred dollars for Louis sneakers because I just feel that shit's just. I prefer streetwear designer than real designer if that makes sense i know it's kind of dumb but i just you know well coming from a guy who has a louis wallet but i feel like for my clothes and stuff i like to have um it's more like streetwear designer compared to just straight designer you know and they're uncomfortable as shit they're so uncomfortable it's like would you rather would you rather buy $200 Gucci slides that look like Nike slides, right? For $200, they're extra uncomfortable. Or would you rather buy Yeezy slides, okay? Even though the resale is the same price, you still get the name, you get better material, better design, it's comfortable. And people, I think it's a better hype over Gucci. So I'd rather spend 200 bucks on a resale of Yeezy slides over buying $200 Gucci slides. You know what I mean? That's that's just me. Yeah, I get it. Retail is 70 bucks, but fucking good luck getting it for retail. Thanks, actually. I like my style, too. Uh, I have a ring. Sorry guys, um, I, I got a ring in the front and I thought it was, um, I thought it was, um, uh, like a delivery of something important, but it was like Mormons and stuff, so I was like, nah. <clears throat> I'm sure they suit me, man. I'm sure I'll find a way to make them look good, but, um, I just wouldn't, I would not want to spend money on them. But if I got out a gift, as a gift, yeah, I'll find a way to wear them, for sure, you know?
<laughs> yeah, no, I, I don't, I don't really open doors to that. Do you watch Dragon Tales? No, I don't. But so funny, I brought up um, Magic School Bus and Bill Nye the Science Guy to woo. He was like, oh yeah, I watched Dragon Tales. Like, oh okay, so I can see like the age gap is we're like a decade apart. So I can see that. But yeah, I, I grew up on Magic School Bus and Bill Nye, man, and I love that shit. I learned, I learned all my life lessons from those shows, dude. I knew how the universe worked. I knew how my body worked. I knew how bees worked, recycling, the immune system, the motherfucking light and spectrums and color. It's just wild, man. Five guys, uh, overpriced and too salty. <laughs> Ashley, relax. I'm relaxing. I, I bet you are. Bro, I'm... <coughs> my biceps is... Bro, I'm cleaning. I, I need to use my biceps to clean. It smells good. One pair or one shoe done. Second one. Um, laces still soaking. Let me get them. Oh, Jim Tim. Oh, you already know I take care of the bottom first, dog. I cleaned the bottom before I went on. Prank call? I mean, when I was a kid, I feel like as an adult, you really shouldn't be prank calling people. Unless you have like mental development issues. I live in SoCal. <laughs> I bet, Jim Tim, I bet. Finish it up. Gotta head out and get lunch, and then we'll probably do, um, yeah, probably do a, a live stream for um, for Instagram. kind of jumped the gun. I didn't take the insole out yet. I'm surprised the the material or like it, um the printing didn't go off. It's like freaking part of the whole entire um like layer of it like it doesn't rub well i mean of course over here a little bit because from my my toe but damn this thing holds off pretty well for wearing a year straight like the insoles are pretty good still aside from like the dirty parts probably from um the hike 
Man, that hike really fucked up these shoes, man. My poor wings. My poor wing. Uh, tequila? I'm not a big fan of tequila, man. I'm not a big fan of drinking in general. I'm more of a toker. Joe's just chilling. I didn't say nothing. <laughs> Bro, you've been saying a lot, Jim, too. Especially to Nick. Bro, the way you get under Nick's skin is hilarious, man. I keep telling him to relax, but... Okay. Hey Joe, they said hi to you. George Washington said hi. That girl's a savage. Oh, I bet you are, brother. You are crazy, Joe. She shoves herself through the doggy door where I put the, the vent for the, the AC and she still squeezes through that. Add cleaning runners to your workout routine, savage. For sure, Ashley. Um, no, I'm not a big fan of Bad Bunny or the Forum Lows. Joe, stop going in and out. Not really, not that much with uh, Bad Bunny. Joe, no. And Travis Scott is not even one of my favorite artists. I just, I just love his, like, um, the reverse swoosh. That's the same thing with the um, upside down trefoil. Just something about it. Of course, like the upside down um, Adidas. Have you guys even noticed? <laughs> I love those little hints. Um, dude, I do actually. Um, um, the homie uh, Eric showed me a really, really good um, Latino song that's really, I like. I don't know how to say it though. Terratino, something um, with Raul and uh, Alejandro, uh, uh, fucking Totino, Terratino, Tor Torretino, whatever. I think that was a really good fucking song. No, it's um, it's Jason Mark. So I don't have the FC 150, but we still in the zone though, because you see the phone. We still in the zone. Welcome back, Shree. Yeah. I really beat these up.
Why do you want to go ice skating with me, bro? I don't know how to ice skate. Get with another quick go around. You guys are so dumb, dude. I think this is good, honestly. After putting them through a hike, not bad. And I'm gonna um, put in new insoles for them. But yeah, don't 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 wear your designer shoes on a hike, guys. Man, let's see how these fit still. These motherfuckers are heavy too. I did what? Oh, maybe if I add um, this is gonna be blasphemous, but I might add like Nike soft insoles in these and see see how they act. Cheers, man. Oh, I'm gonna try something. The Nike High 85s come with these really nice thick insoles already. Nike's doing a really good job with their insoles. Like it's like a really, it's like a, I don't know what type of material this is, but it's amazing. It's kind of like a foamy, rubbery, like responsive foam, and yeah, this thing's amazing. Let's see how it works in here. I'm using Nike insoles in Adidas shoes. I don't give a fuck, and of course it doesn't fit well. I actually prefer Adidas over Nike day of any month, any year. Oh, for sure. I mean, everyone got the brand loyalty. I like my Nikes, man. I like my Jordans. I think they fit better with insoles and stuff, and like their sizing is way more consistent. Adidas, bro, sometimes you want... I'm a 10 and a half in Nike all across the board. Fucking it. Adidas, sometimes I'm a 10, sometimes I'm an 11, sometimes I'm a 10 and a half, sometimes I'm a fucking 9. Yeah, Adidas sizing is all over the place. Oh, dude, that's soft. It's actually really soft. I think I might fuck around with this one and see how it works. Yeah. Nice. I made it fit, so yeah, it fits. <laughs> Nike insole in an Adidas shoes. Uh, these are the Alexander Wings. Uh, Alexander Wing uh, soccer soccer shoes. I still can't believe we got to watch you get all those tattoos. I know the live streams, hey, Anthony. Yeah, dude. I mean, all the all the live stream streams are still there. If you guys want to watch me get blasted over in Vietnam. Trying to like get this in, but it's good, Anthony. How's yours, bro? I'm about to um, head out and get lunch soon. I'm probably going to embarrass my niece at um, Rodeo 39 if she's there. I love the Adidas um, terrestrial free hiker shoes. So many awesome color options. Oh, I have I have their um, I have their hiking shoes actually. Yeah, uh, the Terra X. I have the Terra X with the boost. Yeah. I got a I got a sweet deal like a pair like a blue and orange pair I got for like 
half off, I think. Super, super cheap. Or like a hundred, yeah, probably like around close to half off. I'm going to be wearing those. Terex, I got the pink and baby blue ones. Nice. I got the, the all blue and the hints of orange one. Those are nice. I'm actually going to take those out too, hike. I think uh, the homie Vivian come by. Homegirl Vivian come by. We can uh, go out on a hike. Nice. It feels weird with the Nike insoles in them, but with the boost on top, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty comfy. And it fits my foot where it's not pushing up too high. All right, guys, all done here. Um, I'm gonna let these dry because it's been like fully wet from being scrubbed down. Um, they're not the cleanest, but either way, at least I know the cleaner. Um, I'm gonna head out to Rodeo 39 again and probably see if my niece is working and embarrass her a little bit. And then I'm thinking about doing a video on the onigiri or definitely getting something over there for sure. I just gotta figure out what. And then I might do a live stream since I have footage or and, and stuff to edit for the next couple of days. So. Uh, no, Vietnam, uh, Vietnam has way cheaper because if you go to a different country in a different economy, I paid about a fourth of what you would pay over here for tattoos. Yeah, a fourth. Kind of like close to, uh, if you go to Mexico, same thing, really good, cheap tattoos out there as well. Just saved 150 bucks. Uh, probably Instagram. Instagram. <laughs> yeah, I should go, man. I'm fucking hungry. It's almost 5 o'clock. Um, let me fucking scrub these motherfuckers down just one more time. And then I'll wait for them to be dry. And then I might go back on Instagram, uh, TikTok to lace them up or some shit. I don't know. We'll see. Well, you know, Pound Town varies, Jim Tim. Depends on how dirty, but I prefer just having it soak whatever is out. And then the... Um, the yeah. Okay, I'm gonna keep soaking these, I guess, try to clean them, and then I'm gonna head out to eat. I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for coming in. Peace out. Appreciate y'all.